Hello, uh, today I'm going to show you how to calculate the integral of dx divided by x2 times x minus 1 with the power of 2. Okay, so to solve this integral, you have to first express this rational function as the sum of uh, uh, partial fractions. Okay, so to do that, you write here 1 divided by x2 times x minus 1 with the power of 2 will be equal to a divided by x plus b divided by x2 plus c divided by x minus 1 plus d divided by x minus 1 with the power of 2. Okay, therefore here you can conclude that 1 will be equal to a times x times x minus 1 with the power of 2 plus b times x minus 1 with the power of 2 plus c times x minus 1 times x2 plus d times x2. Okay, so now you can write 1 is equal to, that one will be equal to ax times x2 minus 2x plus 1 plus b times x2 minus 2x plus 1 plus uh, this one will be cx3 uh, minus cx2 plus dx2. Okay, so therefore 1 will be equal to, uh, so here you will have ax3 minus 2ax2 plus ax plus bx2 minus 2bx plus b plus cx3 minus cx2 plus dx2. Okay, therefore 1 will be equal to here, let's factor uh, the terms with, uh, with, with x3, not this one. So therefore this one will be a plus c times x3, okay? And then the one with the x2 will be equal to plus, this one has x2, therefore minus 2a, this one has x2 plus b, and this one as well, minus c plus d times x2, plus the one with x now is this one, that is a minus 2b, that's this one, okay, times x plus uh, the constant, and the only constant is this one, plus b, okay? So therefore here b will be equal to 1, the constant uh, will be equal to 1, the coefficient of uh, uh, x3 is equal to 0, because you don't have x3 on this side, also the coefficient of x2 and the coefficient of x is equal to 0, there, and minus 2a plus b minus c plus d is equal to 0, and a minus 2b is equal to 0, okay? So if you solve these equations, you get that, uh, so basically a will be equal to 2, we already calculated b is equal to 1, c will be minus 2, and d will be equal to 1, okay? So now you have these parameters, you need to substitute these parameters into this uh, equation, basically, okay? And if you do that, <coughs> then you can write, then you can write the integral of dx divided by x2 times x minus 1 with the power of 2 will be equal to the integral of the first term. So here a is equal to 2 and 2 is constant. I take it out of the integral. That will be integral of 2, 2 integral of dx over x. b is equal to 1. That will be integral of dx over x2. Uh, and c is equal to minus 2. And I take it out of the integral. Minus 2 integral of dx divided by x minus 1, and d is equal to 1, plus integral of dx divided by x minus 1 with the power of 2, okay? So the integral of, uh, the integral of the, the dx divided by x is ln x, so that one will be 2 ln x, and the integral of dx over x2 is equal to minus 1 divided by x, and this one will be equal to to uh, the integral of dx over x minus 1 is ln x minus 1, here as well you need this absolute value sign, plus uh, the integral of dx over x minus 1 with the power of 2, this int integral will be equal to minus 1 divided by x minus 1, okay? And uh, plus c, which is the constant of the integral, and that is the solution to our integral. I hope uh, you found this video helpful. If you are interested, please feel free to subscribe to this channel so that you get updated when I upload new videos. Thank you.